I have such a connection to this character and just to the story that it just would be an incredible journey to say that now I get to be a part of the movie too, you know? Yeah. Hey. Danielle. Hey, how you doing? It's a fact that your voice goes up several octaves when Oprah appears. <laughs> so Danielle Brooks explained on ABC's Soul of a Nation Screen Queens Rising what a shock it was to have Oprah appear on her Zoom call when she still thought she was going through the extensive audition process to play Sophia in the adaptation of the film version of the musical of The Color Purple. They were saying, Danielle, you have one more meeting with the director Blitz, and then all of a sudden, this beautiful black woman in purple comes up on the screen, and it's Miss Oprah Ew. Winfrey. <laughs> it was Mama O. I am here representing all things purple to tell you that you are our <laughs> Sophia, Sophia. <laughs> Such a pretty name. Sophia, Sophia. Yes, it is. So Oprah played that role in a 1985 film and was nominated for an Oscar. Then, 20 years later, in 2005, with Oprah as one of the producers, it was adapted into a Broadway musical that ran to 2008. Fantasia played the role of Celie for a year in that run, the role that Whoopi Goldberg played in the film version, and now Fantasia will play that role in the musical film version as well. Danielle, who is best known for her work on Orange is the New Black, played the role of Sophia during the musical's revival in 2015 and earned a Tony nomination for it. Now, after an extensive audition process, Danielle will play the role of Sophia in the musical film version as well. I'm so happy to pass whatever baton from 35, almost 40 years ago to you. And I know you're gonna kill it. Cause look, I saw this, honey. No. Oh my God. When you hit oh. that fist, I said, <coughs> family of men. Yes, no. ma'am. No. So, after that huge Oprah surprise, Danielle still managed to pull it together and articulate what it meant to play this role on film. Oh, that is so Thank you. Thank uh. you. And I tell you, as Oprah, I did not get to thank you enough the first time. No, thank you. I'm so glad I get to tell you face to face. Thank you for the journey that you allowed me to have the first time. Thank you so much. And I'm going oh, to you're making me cry. I'm going to make you so, so proud. I promise. No, well, you already have. You killed that audition. You killed thank that audition. <laughs> you were just, you were Sophia. And uh, on behalf of Steven Spielberg and Quincy Jones and Scott Sanders and Blitz, of course, and myself, I wanted to be the one to tell you because, you know, I have such love for her, this character, everything she represents and everything she brought to my life. And what I'm hoping is that she does the same thing for you. Thank you. So it actually got me really emotional watching Danielle's reaction to Oprah because <sighs> Danielle has worked hard for where she has gotten. You know, her role in Orange is the New Black, she had a bit part and it slowly expanded and she was, you know, got a fairly substantial role, but she's not a household name. So she went through the extensive audition process to play that role in the film version and now she's got it. It's just someone that has worked so hard for her opportunities and is getting this huge opportunity that Danielle strikes me as someone who's never been handed any opportunities on a silver platter. She is super talented, but she hasn't gotten through that door because she's a black woman, probably. So the idea that she's worked hard for this and she's gotten that, I think she's earned it. But yeah, what do you think of this casting for the musical film version of The Color Purple? <laughs> 